If you've ever watched hockey, you might think it's a chaotic and unpredictable game. But even the best coaches aren't always sure if they made a well-informed decision. One company is using the power of AI to help coaches turn seemingly disorganized gameplay into powerful analytics with a competitive edge. I'm Arjun Dutt with NVIDIA, and this is I Am AI. I was a sports stats geek, and I loved mathematics, and I loved the sports, so I thought that there is uh, like a natural blend between the two, and this is what my life should be all about. Hockey is the most complex sport. Every year it's getting tougher and tougher to get that edge, to, to get that uh, competitive advantage over, over other teams, especially in such competitive leagues. I realized there is no automatic data collection technology in hockey. So every team, every league is collecting data manually. Probably take you 10 man hours at least to try and get a big chunk of those stats just recorded. Now you've got to sort them and now you've got to filter them and everything and there's just not enough time before your next game to, to prepare. You might get everything done and then the next game started, you're missing the time to actually implement that stuff. So how can AI accelerate this process to ensure that coaches get the information they need in time to make a difference? Iceberg Sports Analytics is a platform that collects the information from hockey games and presents it on a user-friendly portal that allows you to analyze your team or player performance. We've developed a hardware system that has three cameras, and each camera is tracking each zone, so we have a panoramic view of the ice rink. The cameras capture the whole 200-foot surface of the ice rink. It tracks each player 10 times per second. What we have in a raw data set is about a million data points of player movements, referees' movements, and also the puck coordinates. After the game, you upload it to our cloud. Then using artificial intelligence, the game is broken down for you so the coaches don't have to spend time breaking down the video themselves. A hockey game can be explained by four basic uh, events. It's skating, a uh, pass, a shot attempt, and a reception. Reception is just any puck touch. And we are applying some machine learning algorithms to identify those four events. When you log into our system, uh, you're going to see your basic analytic stats, your shots on goal, uh, your total shots, your face-offs, your possession percentage, which is who possessed the puck more in that game. There are other metrics that are more unique to Iceberg, like XG. XG corresponds to expected goals, and this concept tells you what's the probability of a specific shot or any event in the game to be resulted in a goal. The key lies in their use of a special class of recurrent neural network that uses long short-term memory, or LSTM units. An LSTM unit uses memory from previous states, as well as current data, to predict the likelihood of a future event. When provided video from a game, the early stages of Iceberg's system perform player identification, team composition, and calculation of player and puck trajectories. These initial levels of information allow Iceberg's LSTM network to generate more insightful data about the flow of events in a game. Iceberg uses this data at deeper levels of the system to generate advanced metrics, such as the expected goal timeline. The Iceberg system recognizes complex events, such as a zone entry, a power play, or an intercepted pass, and interprets how these events affect the likelihood of a goal being scored. we felt that not all shots are equal, so we've attached the probability metric to each shot to improve that analysis for the teams. And this way you can identify which players are actually bringing you the value from the offensive side of the game. So you're only gonna have one leading scorer on a team. That's, you know, everyone else, you gotta figure out what their strength is, what they're bringing to the table. Back in the day, uh, you only had goals and an assist, so you didn't know who got the puck from A to B, which set up that goal. But now with analytics, the guy that doesn't stick out to you, you may notice uh, a diamond in the rough. We rely on coaches' uh, feedback a lot. We are trying to build a solution for hockey coaches by hockey coaches. But hockey is often so complex 
that coaches can often disagree on what happened in any given play. How do they feel about another set of eyes, objectively evaluating every move of each player? As a coach, I think good coaches, you're, you're constantly learning. And, and if you have a, a, a technology as powerful as this and it, it doesn't change the way you look at things, I think you're missing more than half the battle. It's nice to have the data and the video and the information uh, to get the guys ready to go the next day. Whether, you know what, hey, if it backs you up, great on what you thought right away, but either way, you wanna know as a coach if you were right or if you were wrong and, and how to correct it. I wondered, how is Iceberg able to deliver analytics in a time frame that teams can actually use? We had been using CPUs in production, but it took us uh, more than 15 hours to produce one game and we realized that we had to switch to GPUs to decrease the production time because our clients needed the data faster. Part of the reason why we switched to GPUs is we had to cut the production costs. We've cut our costs more than twice, and also the production time right now is only five hours, which is a significant improvement. I see Iceberg evolving into other sports. The first thought is soccer. Another sport that I think it'll delve into really quickly is lacrosse. Right now, I don't believe there's any analytic stats in lacrosse. Our technology and the product is easily scalable because it's fully automated. So for us, it doesn't matter if it's 50 clients or 10,000 clients, we just need to rent more computing power to produce the games. And that's the beauty of computer vision and automation.